Now in downtown Charleston, we're following breaking news. A bomb squad is working the scene where a post-Civil War era shell casing was found. News 2's Hannah Powers is live for us along East Bay Street. And Hannah, you spoke with the man who says that he actually found that shell casing. That's right, Temple. And at this time, we do know the Charleston Police Department has confirmed that what was found was a post Civil War artillery shell. And I did just get to speak with the man who says that he found the item while working on a construction project. We came across what we thought was a little small urn or a barrel. We wasn't sure. Um, we took it outside and realized that it was some sort of ordinance. Um, so we moved it to the parking lot and did a little more information on it from Google and it's actually what they call a Paris bomb that was fired from Fort Sumter. So at that time we called 911. He did tell me that the item was quite heavy, around 40 to 50 pounds, and he said once the group found out what it was, they were pretty scared. As far as what the situation is down here right now, Prelude Street still closed. Same with East Bay Street here by the old exchange building. So if you're planning on traveling this way, they're diverting all traffic, and actually the office buildings that are close to the incident have also been evacuated. Heavy police presence. There's fire trucks, bomb squads still here. They're just taking every precaution to make sure that everyone stays safe until they further identify the object. REPORTING LIVE IN DOWNTOWN CHARLESTON, I'M HANNAH POWERS. COUNT ON TWO.